A couple weeks ago, I went to a conference in Montreal. It was one of those things that work sent me to. So it was super awesome because I went on the company's dime. I got to stay in a really nice hotel and I got to experience a lot of great things. I'm going to keep talking, but here's some of the footage from when I was out on my trip. When I was driving to the airport and checking in and everything else going into the hotel room. It was a super awesome experience, but I have to admit, I'm not really good at the whole conference and networking thing. A lot of the other conferences that I've gone to in the past, I typically go like a student. I'll go to the sessions, I'll take notes, I'll absorb the information. I very rarely feel like it's necessary for me to ask questions, and that's kind of the extent of it. In terms of the big conference style meet and greets and whatnot, I'm usually the shy one. I'll, I'll make conversation with people beside me, but typically I don't even really network all that much. I'm very much of the kind of person that sticks with the people that I know and do the things that I'm used to. And if that means I'm in an environment that I'm not really all that used to, I typically default to a fairly low energy state, stay in the hotel room and not really do anything adventurous. Now this conference was for the Research Ethics Board, so I was there for two different reasons. I was there for my work, the one who was paying for the conference, but also because I'm a chair of another Research Ethics Board, I went to think, how can I bring stuff from this conference, the learnings from it, back and improve my board? So it was really important that I was on my A game in terms of not just absorbing the information and figuring out what I can do to, to improve things when I get back, but also how can I start to develop some of those deeper connections with other people so that in the future I can reach out to people if we need things. And I have to say, networking doesn't come naturally to me. I mean, I think a lot of people will say networking doesn't come naturally to them, even people who it comes natural to, but I am really terrible at networking. I have a hard time making small talk with people. I mean, on the camera, I may seem like I'm an outgoing person, but that's because I'm playing a part for the camera. But when I'm in an environment where I'm not comfortable or that I'm in an environment that everything's kind of new for me, I typically am more inward reflecting and kind of introverted. So I made it my mission at this conference to get outside of my comfort zone and do things that I normally wouldn't do. And then I made a point. I wasn't hanging around people that were my colleagues normally. I met new people, struck up conversations, made sure that I was taking an interest in their own work and their own lives and whatnot so that I can make those interesting and deeper connections. In addition to getting outside of my comfort zone with networking with people, I also was out of my comfort zone with being in a new city by myself. I could have just stayed at the hotel restaurant when I wanted to eat, but no. I went out, ventured around, I had some traditional Montreal smoked meat, and I went out to dinner with some people that I hadn't met before until the conference, and I had a generally good time. But at the same time, I also have my limits, so I would go out and explore an adventure, I'd go out to dinner with new people, and then at the end of the day, I'd go back to the hotel room to have a nice quiet evening by myself. And I think at a network, the kind of implicit assumption is that you're always going to be extroverted and outgoing, but I think it's all about striking a balance of what works for you. You know, what kind of goals you want to set for yourself and what kind of plans you want to implement. And in the end, it was a good time. I brought back a lot of great information. I met some great people and it was a good learning experience. It was a good opportunity to practice these skills. If I've learned one thing from the experience, networking is not my thing. It's not really a good excuse to stop you from putting yourself out there and trying new things. And I think that's the most important lesson. Anyways, take care and stay awesome.